Hello everyone, welcome back to my famous YouTube channel to watch more creative videos on Node.js and MongoDB. As we have gone through many videos on Node.js and MongoDB, such as sign up form, login and registration form using Node.js and MongoDB, feedback form using Node.js and MongoDB, displaying data in JSON format using Node.js and MongoDB. We are also seeing session handling using Node.js and many many more videos on Node.js and MongoDB. Today's video is really interesting and innovative. Today we are going to see a login system using Node.js and MongoDB. First of all, we will go to models directory. We will go to the code of the program source code. So first of all, we will go to the models directory. In that, you are having user this is a very important part structure of how, how what field we are going to enter in the database that are mentioned here then we will shift to the uh, public directory In that, we will go to JavaScript directory. Bootstrap program is very large, it is very, very lengthy. Then, we will shift to style sheet, designing part of the web page. This is all about the designing part. Now we will shift to the views directory front end part. In that we are having five files, six files I think. Five. First of all, errors. It will be displayed. layout how the web page will look on the screen according to different different laptops then login this part register part register part very important now we will shift to the just now we have shifted to views table root the roots directory and at the last we will go to the node.js file that is job main javascript file at the last now in roots directory we will see users js file very important i have struggled a lot for this file loading the required drivers then first of all register then login then authenticate the login with username and password and then if login successful then index dot html file will be displayed registration in there and then validation email should not be empty and this part email should contain at the rate symbol that is very important for create for entering the data in the form and uh, i have struggled lot for this part also and i have struggled for this part of logout part now i will go through the main javascript file app.js be careful about loading the drivers which are very much needed npm install then path of the root directories then views engine through which you, you are able to view the browser program on the screen on the browser 
login index uh, page, HTML file when login is such this page will be displayed and here uh, names uh, name length should be more than this part validator just uh, I want to remind I have struggled I have struggled lot for this part I have struggled lot for this part also now we have completed all the code now we will execute the program Sorry, 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 sorry. Yes, server has been started now. By default, I have taken port number as three thousand only. Many programs are taken three thousand only. Yes, first of all, register. An Ankush email Ankush at the rate gmail.com username Ankush one password Ankush one to the image of Ankush. First time I am storing the images in the database MongoDB database. Yes, now I will log in. Push one password. Yes, login successful. Ankush page will be displayed. Welcome Ankush. Now I will log out. Yes, I struggled a lot for this lo logout page. Now I will again register. Amitabh email id amitabh at the rate gmail.com username amitabh1 oh, be careful while giving Amitabh password Amitabh Now I will take the image of Amitabh Bachchan okay. Yes Log Registration is done Now login Password Okay, Yes, Amitabh page also it has been displayed. So, I have successfully done with login system using Node.js and MongoDB. I have taken more and more efforts to create this video. Please share me in comments if you like this video. Please subscribe to my channel. I will be back with more videos on Node.js, MongoDB, Python, Flask, Machine Learning, Stimulite, Java, PHP. Thanks for watching. Log out. I will log out. So first, I, I will show you here the records. This two records has been saved in the MongoDB database.